Okay, so we're already at week two of ZBLL. So, well, already. I'm filming this the same day as the other one, so. Yeah, a week bent, went by pretty fast, like two minutes. Okay, anyway, so, yeah, it's the anti-2GLL, so, yeah, okay, so the first case is, so there's going to be a bar here, and it's not going to match up over there, and then, I think that's all you have to know. Yeah, oh, you have to know that there's no bar here, but if the only bar is this, and then here the only bar is on the right. So yeah. So what you do is for this one you hold it like this. And it actually starts out like an R perm. Or an R U D R perm. An R A I think. R U prime R prime U R U R D. That R perm. So this alg goes D. And then instead of finishing off the R perm, you just do R prime U R D prime R two. So yeah. And then for this, I'm sure some people use this for the, their R perm, but this is a lot less common. It still works for an RB perm, but it's just the backward thing of that. You hold it like this. R prime U, R U, R prime U prime, R prime D prime, R U prime, R prime D, R two. And for this set, there's not going to be as many alg easy algs as the last one, so you're going to want to track pairs a lot. Okay, so, okay, and, okay, so, now we have when there's going to be one bar on the side, so, that, and that's the only bar, so there, and these are just the inverses of the last case, except for this one, there's two algs I'm going to show you. And technically, you could use this alg and its inverse and its mirrors for the other four case for the other three cases of these, but this is the only one that I find it's even gonna be as fast, if even as fast. So, um, I'll show you the first alg. So it's just the inverse of the other one. R prime d prime r r two d prime r u r d r u r u prime r prime u prime r. So, I'll show you the other alg, r prime u two r, and then you're just gonna do this VLS, with the radiation, whatever. Well, sort of a different alg for it. So it goes f u prime. Insert the pair, r prime u prime r u f prime. So that's a lot more move efficient, but I'm not sure how much better will it be. So, for this case, when the bar is here, you put it in back. R2, D, R prime, U prime, R, D prime. R prime, U prime, R prime, U, R, U, R prime. So I guess those are sort of similar to R perms. And, no, that, they're just the inverses, so they shouldn't be that hard to learn. Okay, so, now we have the cases where you have... Two bars. So for this case, you're gonna have two bars, and you'll see two bars. You don't really need to know where. I guess it's sort of like recognizing J perms. But for this, all you really need to know is if the bar is on the if the like flat. If the bar is on the right or the left, like the bar that's on the side. So for this, the bar is on the left. For this, the bar is on the right. So when it's on the left. Well, for both cases, you'll hold it like this. So for this one, R, U2, R2, F, R, F prime. So it's sort of like the beginning of an OLL, or fish OLL, I think that's what it's called. So R, U2, R prime, and then sledge, so like that. M prime, so I guess this is a VLS now, but, you know, no one knows it. So M prime, insert the pair. U prime, R, U, R prime, U, M. Okay, now for this. So, for this case, you take this back pair out. 
r prime u2 r f u prime r prime u r u r prime u r u prime f prime uh yeah so again track the pairs i don't want to really show my thought process because this video is going to take way too long but just figure out how to track pairs it'll make it a lot easier okay so now we have the solid block Alright, so, this is when you have a solid block, yeah, like a 2x2, two two. yeah, so it's like that, or that, so, start, when it's on the left, you start with R U R prime U L prime, inverse sexy, L, and then just insert the pair. So that's actually a pretty easy algorithm to memorize. Pair. And then for this one, I guess there's actually, again, there's two algs. You could do the inverse of that, but I prefer R prime, U prime, R, U prime. And then see this pair. So F, U prime, R prime, U, R, U, R prime, U prime, R prime, U, R, U prime, F prime. So it's similar to the second case I showed of the double bar algs, but yeah, you'll have to figure out how it's similar. It's, it's very similar though. And then if you want to do the inverse of the other one, it would just go like, R, it's very easy to learn, R U R prime U L prime, and then instead of inverse sexy, you do sexy L insert the pair. So yeah. Okay, so. Now we have the two cases with no bars, or the two sets of the four cases. Okay, so I'm just going to say three out of four of these algs, I don't really know a good alg. Um, I guess I know a good alg, but it's not the best. I know there's better. So this is the first one. So these are when you have, um, it, it looks sort of like an E perm. So actually how you know is you'll see there's no opposites out of this block. There's no opposites relative to the corners, not including these two back here. So, and then for this, you could either recognize it's an E perm, so like these two corners match the edge here. How I would, I would probably do that. And then for this one, I, act, I don't recognize it usually that these two red are opposite of orange. I usually just see the bar here and the bar here. But it doesn't, either way it works. So for this one, you do, you just do a simple alg twice. So it's another ZBLL. So F, R, U prime, R prime, U, R, U2, R prime, U prime. You do that twice. Instead of doing an F prime, because the alg starts with F, so you just don't do the F prime. And then you do R, U prime, R prime, U prime, R, U2, R prime u prime f prime and then for this one i know there's a more efficient alg jabari showed me but um yeah it's i don't know it uh so i actually originally learned this from chris olsen a really wa long time ago so again there's a bar here and a bar here or these two corners are opposite of that so you hold it like this and then you do Wide R, U, R prime, U prime, M, insert the pair, and then F sexy F prime. So if you couldn't tell, that was just this OLL like this, and then F sexy F prime. So yeah. Okay, now for the last cases. So that alg is definitely all right. In fact, it might be better than the other one, finger trick wise. So these are the ones where I really... Don't I don't like them. So So this so you have an opposite opposite these two are opposite and then here these two are opposite. So what you do for this when opposites are here, do 
m u prime m prime f sexy f prime so that took the edge out and then just put the edge back in so m u m prime it's not that good and then for this I, this alg is a little better especially for oh so it's that so you hold it like this it goes f double sexy f prime and then I guess you could cancel and then do lefty f sexy f prime but that's not as good so what I do is f double sexy f prime u prime and then the alg from this angle r prime f prime u prime f u r so those two algs are really easy to learn but they might not be the best so if you want you can look for some better algs and if you do find any I'd really like you to put it in the comments because I sort of looked and I couldn't really find any good outs. So, yeah. Now I'm going to go to bed because I don't want to film any more of these. Okay, bye.